In the heart of Africa, on the Rwandan shores of Lake Kivu, an innovative project is taking shape, one that will capture large amounts of methane gas deep within the water and generate 100 megawatts of electricity for the region, while also reducing the risk of a methane and carbon dioxide release into the atmosphere. Let's take a look at methane extraction at Lake Kivu. A barge with sophisticated equipment is moored on the lake. Large diameter pipes are placed deep below the surface to draw in gas-laden water. Natural pressure forces the water up toward the surface into a separator. As the water reaches a certain depth, gas begins to separate from it, much like opening a champagne bottle. This separation triggers an auto-siphoning process and continues pushing the gas and water upward. Degas water is returned safely to the lake to maintain the ecosystem balance. As they rise, the gas and water enter a separator, a large cylindrical vessel located about 20 meters below the gas extraction platform. Here, gas is flashed off and collected in a pipe. This mixture containing methane, carbon dioxide, and hydrogen sulfide is sent to a wash tower on the barge and cleaned. As the gas leaves the wash tower, the carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide are removed, leaving high-quality methane gas, perfect for producing electric power. Further processing dries and compresses the methane for export to a shore-based power plant. Purified methane is then transported by a submerged pipeline to a power plant for electrical generation.